Good morning everyone! I'm here to present to you a detailed lesson plan in science. It's all about the mixture and solution. I am Archie de Garcia, student teacher of Isabel State University, 11 campus, taking Bachelor of Secondary Education, major in general science. The objectives of lesson plan. At the end of the lesson, the student should be able to give the meaning of mixture and solution, compare and contrast between the mixture and solution, give an example of mixture and solution, and discuss methods of separating mixture and solution into their original components. Good morning, class. Good morning, Good morning sir. sir. Let us pray first. Father God, come be with us today. Fill our minds with learning. Fill our lesson with fun. Fill our school with love. Amen. Amen. Please stay present when I call your name. Blaster. Present. James. Present. Jump. Present. Jasper. Present. Roy. Present. Carla. Present. Princess. Present. King. Present. Present. Fia. And Tom. Present. Please pick up a paper under your chair. So how was your weekend class? It, it was, was great, great sir. sir. That's good. Last meeting, we discussed about the change of the state and the two types of change of the state. Isn't it, class? Yes, yes sir. sir. Okay, let's see if you still remember. What is change of the state? Sir. sir. Yes, Jasper? Matter changes state when energy in the form of heat is added to or removed from a substance. Absolutely. How about the two types of change of state? Sir. Sir. Yes, princess? Physical change and chemical change. Very good. Class, I will perform a simple experiment. So please observe and listen. Is that clear, class? Yes, yes sir. sir. I have here a two glass of water. I will put an object into the glass of water and try to look if it is a mixture or a solution. Is that clear, class? Yes, yes sir. sir. I will add a one tablespoon of sand into the first glass of water. Now, class, is this a mixture or a solution? Sir. sir. Yes, Jasper. Mixture, sir. It is a mixture. Very good. It is a mixture because the sand and the water stay separate. The sand does not disappear in the water. Now, I will add a one tablespoon of salt into the water. Class, is this a mixture or a solution? Yes, sir. princess. Solution, sir. It is a solution. Very good. It is a solution because the salt dissolve or disappear into the liquid. Class, based from our experiment, what did you observe? Sir. Yes, princess. The activity is all about mixture and solution. Very good. It is a mixture and solution. What is the difference between a solution and a mixture? When you have ever made a chocolate milk? Have you ever noticed what happened if you let your chocolate milk sit for a while? Well, sometimes chocolate will settle on the bottom of the glass. This is because it is a mixture. Mixture are any combination of two or more items. Sometimes the two or more ingredients look all the same when mixed together and sometimes they do not. Okay, let's first define what is mixture. Sir. Yes, Kim. Mixture is made up of two or more substances that can be separated physically. Very good. Mixture, when two or more kinds of matter are put together, it is called mixture. Mixtures can be made with solid, liquid, and gases. Any combination will be resolved in a mixture. 
Once made, mixture can be separated using mechanical screening or filtering processes. Now, can you give me an example of mixtures? Sir. Yes, Japet. Sugar and water, sir. Neither the sugar nor the water loses its properties when they are mixed together. Absolutely. How about when you mix salt and water, the solid seems to disappear in the water. This process called? Sir. Yes, Kim? This process is called dissolving and will form a solution. Very good. Now, will you identify what is solution? Sir. Yes, Jasper? Solution is a special type of mixture. Absolutely. Solution is a special type of a mixture in a solution that ingredients are distributed evenly throughout solution can be made solid, liquid, and gases. Can you give me an example of solution? Sir. Yes, right. Brass is a solid solution. Absolutely. What else? Sir. Yes, stone. Tea is a liquid solution. All of you are correct. In a solution, the substance that is present in this greater amount is called solvent. Can you give me an example of solvent? Sir. Yes, princess? Water is the most common solvent. Very well said. Why the substance present in the smaller amount is called solute? A solute is a something that dissolves in the liquid and a solvent is a liquid that something dissolves in. The solute dissolved in the solvent. In a salt water solution, the salt water is solute and the water is the solvent. Can we separate the salt water from the salt water solution? Sir. Yes, Carla? Yes, sir. Very good. Yes, the salt can be retrieved by evaporating the water from the liquid to a gas, leaving only the salt behind. When a solid is dissolved in a liquid, we call the liquid a solvent, and the solid is called the solute. Can you separate mixture and solution back into their original components? Sir. Yes, Tony. Yes, you can. Absolutely. Sometimes, you can separate out the parts of a mixture using something and you see as a filter screen. You cannot use a filter or a screen to separate other parts of the solution. Therefore, another way to separate mixture and solution is the use of the three phases of matter, the solid, a liquid, and the gas. Who remember the solid phase of a water? Sir. Yes, Tony. Sir, ice. Very good. The solid phase of water is ice. How about the liquid phase? Sir. Yes, Japet. Sir, water. Very good. The liquid phase is water. How about the gas phase? Sir. Yes, steam. Sir, steam. Very good. The gas phase is steam. Now, class, I will give you a questionnaire about our topic for you to understand clearly our lesson. Now, class, we will check your paper. Yes, yes sir. sir. The answer for number one is C. The answer for number two is B. The number three is A. The number four is B. The number five is C. Now, let's move for the identification. Number six, mixture. Number seven, solution. Number eight, mixture. Number nine, solution. Number ten, mixture. Who got the perfect score? Sir. Sure. Very good, Blesser and Japan. Based from the activity a while ago, can you identify now mixture and solution? Yes, yes sir. sir. Now, which of the three phase is air in? Yes, princess. Gas, sir. Very good. It is the gas. Now, how about the table and chairs in this room? Yes, Kim. 
Solid, sir. Very good. It is solid. How about the orange juice? Yes, Japan. Liquid, sir. Very good. It, it, the, it is the liquid. How about the salt in the sand? It is a mixture or solution. Yes, right? Mixture, sir. Very good. It is a mixture. All of you are correct. Now, what is the difference between a mixture and solution? The difference between a mixture and solution is a mixture is a medium of two or more kind of matter. But sometimes you can still see the different components like sand and water. In a mixture, all the different parts retain their original properties. A solution is a special type of a mixture that is homogeneous where you cannot tell the difference between the components. Class, I want you to reflect on this question. How do we use mixture and solution in our daily lives? I'd like to emphasize to you, class, the importance of mixture and solution in your daily lives to ensure that you are well-versed in the any circumstances that may occur. Are you done with your reflection, class? Yes, yes sir. sir. In your assignment, in a one-half sheet of paper, give and describe the combustion. That's all for today, class. Goodbye, Goodbye sir. Class.